All right, so we're going to try doing glycoside formation now. Now we're going starting with beta d glucopyranose, and we're going to try doing an acid catalyzed glycoside. Now we might see this, for example, with nomenclature like CH3OH, H2SO4 in an organic reaction. So uh, that's what we'll try it with. So. Anytime you have that, that means that we're starting with the alcohol as the protonating species. So uh, CH3OH is going to attack the hydrogen here and become protonated to give us this, me this uh, protonated methanol, which we're going to use for our, our reaction. Okay, so our more, our more reactive of the two groups at the hemiacetal is our alcohol, has the better pKa for protonation, and that means that it's going to get protonated and it's going to help that oxygen out in doing so. And we're going to end up getting a, again, a good leaving group here. Now that could always be reversed, just go backwards. Or we can force it off to form our oxonium ion. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to tack down and I'm going to go up and I'm going to form an oxonium intermediate. Now, if we had used the water here, we could just do meter meter rotation. Um, but we're going to use our methanol to do the attack here. So I'm going to make a alpha glycoside. So if it's alpha, that means that the tail and the new position should be opposite. So that means my methanol that I just freed up going to attack from the bottom and it's going to give a pair back to our oxygen there. Okay, not, not quite the end of the road here, but we can. So we're going to now have this little guy So we had one come in attack. Now methanol is also our solvent here. So we'll have some of that free around. And to finish this, we're just going to deprotonate to regenerate our acid catalyst. So we're going to end up with our alpha D glycoside. It's alpha because the tail and the new group are on opposite sides, and I'll put on all these guys. So to name this, we would name this a methyl, the methyl group here, and it's always named for the thing that's attached. It's a methyl alpha D gluco pyranos. that little lacer. Methyl alpha D glucopyranoside. Glucopyranoside. So methyl D Methyl alpha D glucopyranoside.